today. I'm Darren from KVC Industrial Supply, the product marketer for Schneider Electric. Today, I will share to you about Schneider Digital Power Meter PM8240. The most common problems users will encounter are what are the basic settings for PM8240 to work correctly and where to view the measured value. Our first sharing is basic setting for PM8240 are work nominal values, CT setting and VT setting. You will need to connect voltage supply to PM8240 to turn on the meter. The first page you will see when you turn on the power meter is summary. To do setting, press the home button at the middle of the meter. Then press down button to set up menu. And press enter. Press down button until you see meter setup. And press enter. Press down button until you see words mode and press enter press the left button to highlight words mode press edit the default password is all zero press ok press up or down to set the wire configuration such as three phase four wire or three phase three wire or single phase the default setting is 3 phase 4 wire 4W-WYE and press enter. If the meter is installed at LV panel, then no need to set VT. If meter is installed in MV switch gear, then you need to set the VT value. To set the VT value, press the down button to PT CT setup. Let's say it is for 11 kV switch gear and the CT ratio is 250 5A. First, press the button at the left to highlight the value of PT primary. Press edit. Press up to change the value to 11,000. Press OK to confirm the change. Next, press the button at the left to highlight PT secondary and change accordingly. For this demo, we will set to 120V. Okay. Next, press the down button at the left to highlight the value of CT primary and repeat the same step as PT setting. Press down to nominal value, edit the nominal voltage, current and frequency. The setting setup will be the same as editing PT slash CT value. Next sharing is how to view the measured value. The first page you will see in the meter is the summary page. In this page, you can read average voltage, average current, total energy consumption and power factor value. To view other parameter, press home button to enter the main menu. You will see in the main menu, there are current, voltage, power, energy, power quality, alarm and etc. For example, to view current parameter, press down until cursor reach current and press OK. You will see the current average and current per phase value. Some of the user will find the alarm is disappearing because it always go off. We will share how to disable the unwanted alarm. Press home button to enter the main menu. Press down to find the alarm setup.
Press OK. Press up or down to navigate through the alarms. To disable unwanted alarm, press up and down button simultaneously. Press OK to accept the change. This is how you enable and disable alarm. That's all for today. Feel free to tell us what are the topics that you like us to cover. Thank you.